Hello, everyone. Welcome to Real Rifle in Rome. So, you guys are probably wondering what this channel is all about. Uh, so basically, I will guess I'll get into the nitty and gritty. This channel is basically a channel for the outdoorsman. A channel for people to be able to go out, you know, wake up in the morning or at night, whatever time you get up in the morning, because honestly, I get up at 3 p.m., so it's pretty cool here. But um, what this channel is for is basically I'm going to be doing some gun shooting, right? I'm going to be going shooting at the shooting range. I'll be going camping. I'll be going fishing. There's a whole bunch of stuff on this channel that's going to happen. Concurrently, I am still waiting on, you know, right now in Ohio, it is currently 20 degrees outside. So the only really thing I can do right now is go shooting. But I promise that it will be much, much better when, you know, I don't have to do that that much. So, so today you're probably wondering, well, what are we going to do today? Today what we're going to go do is we are going to go shoot an AK-47. It's semi-auto, shoots 762 by 39 and yeah, pretty much, that's pretty much all we're going to do today. Um, and I will update you guys when I get there, and I'll see you soon. All right. We have officially made it to Midwest Shooting Center, so what we're going to do is we're going to go in. I might go look around for a little bit because I'm curious, but that's just me though. Uh, but I'm going to go look around for a little bit at some guns. Um, and then we're going to go run out that shot, uh, that AR, the AK. Sorry, stuttered a little bit. I have a problem with stuttering. It just doesn't, doesn't mean I don't know what I'm doing. I just talk too fast. But uh, we're going to go in. We're going to go shoot. And uh, we're going to have ourselves a good time because that's all that matters. Um, but, yeah, today's my first time ever shooting a sh an AK-47. So... Let's just see how this goes. Went to fire, it didn't fire. What's wrong? I have put a on the floor. Just let it down, go forward. It's a chamber. Here you go. It's chambered in. Okay. Thanks, bud.
<laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Was the end. That was awesome. AK-47. I would actually want to kick back, but it didn't. Cool. All right. Yeah, we're good. Let's bring it back in. So we got. What's up? I heard a little bit. <laughs> first time shooting an AK? Yeah, first time. Yeah. It's fun. Oh, yeah, I can tell. <laughs> My shots are everywhere. Oh, man. Yeah, that's. Well, I got way back there. It was at 16.7. I think. No, that's not bad. No, no, that's not bad. I did not hit an X though. <laughs> I hit close to it though. Let's go count that. Yeah. Holy shit. You got him either way. I know I did. I got him. <laughs> oh man. That's cool though. That's awesome. All right. I just got back from shooting the AK-47. What a nice gun. I'm, so, I'm kind of sorry that I can't really talk in there. You know, it's all loud in there. So you can't really hear that much. It's kind of like, you know, like, I guess it's kind of like, it's just awkward for me to talk. Like, I feel, like I'm kind of camera shy. I should probably admit that. I know it's kind of dumb. I'm doing a vlogging channel doing, but you know what? Basically... When I when I'm like talking like this loud and to like a bunch to a bunch of people, I, it's just weird because er, er, range people are all over the place, and I can't really talk because it's you're really shooting a gun. That's like the main the main focus of the video is for me to shoot a gun. Like a lot of other people, like when they drive cars and stuff, they're like talking a lot. It's kind of not really able to talk a lot when you have like yeah I don't know 400 decibels going into your ear every time, <laughs> but. In all honesty, um, today we went out, we shot an AK-47, and now I can say that I officially did shoot an AK-47. Um, one, The cool thing about that gun, though, is that it actually outputs the gas that is fired from it. So every time you fire it, it heats up, that, uh, it heats up the barrel, and basically it goes into this like gas compression chamber, and then it pushes out the air producing hot air out of the gun so that it never really jams or overheats, which I find that amazing because that is co so cool that they, that's what, that's what they do instead of, you know, um, like an, a like in my AR 15, when you shoot it, just the barrel gets hot, right? That one, the barrel gets hot, but it pushes out the air so that it's not overheating and that it's not jamming. And I think that is an awesome way to show that I feel because the AK-47 I think began actually in Russia which I think is awesome because now that it's made its way to America and it's been in America it's like people you know it's just gotten so much better and honestly I can tell you word for word that the recoil felt um, not as good as the shotgun not as good as the XXP Hunter but I can confirm that the shotgun was pretty cool and that the whenever I shot that thing, it felt amazing. Um, I'm sorry I couldn't really show you the gun. I mean, you get to see, like, the tip of it. But um, pretty much, I kind of was, like, limited with what I can do. I, I kind of, I'm trying to find a day where I can go to, like, a range that's not filled with people. Like, don't get me wrong, I love Midwest Shooting Center. Uh, but to be honest, I need a place where I can shoot my own range. And I'm, what I, my idea is that I want to try to maybe build a channel like this one and I can go out and do that. And then I can produce much better content for you guys. And I want to be able to show you how much I appreciate y'all for tuning in and watching these videos. But yeah, aside from that, uh, I'm probably going to go relax. Uh, my shoulder is definitely going to need it. I'm probably going to have to go put it back into place. Currently, it's like all droopy right now. But, uh, yeah, so, uh, I'm gonna go home, relax, and then 
yeah, so I guess I'll talk to you guys later and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.